Revelations, a devotional series from Feeding Hope Fellowship where we are proclaiming the way, the truth, and the life of the Torah and Yeshua. Let's get started. Matthew 24, 10 through 12. And then shall many be offended and shall betray one another and shall hate one another. And many false prophets shall arise and shall deceive many. And because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. I want to share with you about five years ago, uh, my life, my spiritual walk with God, it began to transition a little bit. It was like he was bringing me up to the next level. Um, And there were several verses that had a huge impact on this transformation. Uh, And we'll discuss all of these in future devotions. But... The impact was great, and, and and my eyes just began to open. The Holy Spirit was pushing me to dive deeper into the meaning of words in Scripture, and one of these words was iniquity. I had to know what iniquity meant. Here's what I found out. I'm going to read you the definition. Iniquity is the condition of being without law through contempt or ignorance. Let me read it one more time. The condition of being without law through contempt or ignorance. Now, that's the biblical definition. So, law is not just some abstract word here. It actually has its own meaning. And when the scriptures are talking about law, they're not talking about the, the law of the day at that time or, or anything, which, we're, you know, technically I guess they are because the law of that day was the law in that region was the law of God, the what they call the Mosaic law. It's not Moses' law. It's God's law, and it never changes. But at the condition of being without that law through contempt or ignorance Let me ask you something in relation to the verse. Are people offended today? Well, yeah, I mean, it's like it's off the charts, isn't it? There is no sense of loyalty either. Even family is betraying family. But in verses 11 and 12, that's what I really want to focus on for the moment. It talks about false prophets in the last days. It talks about them abounding. It's it, What it's telling you is this is the great apostasy that Paul talked about. This is the great falling away that Isaiah and Obadiah talked about. Y'all, it's happening. But what are they falling away from exactly? In context, the law of God. Iniquity is lawlessness. In a nutshell, here's what Jesus is teaching in these verses. People will be offended, betray each other, hate each other, and false prophets will abound because of the hate man has for God's law. Is this where we are today? I think it is. Turn on your news or your social media. Look at Facebook, and I think you'll get your answer pretty quick. People are offended like crazy. People hate each other like crazy. Listen to most pastors today for long enough and you'll hear everything but obedience to God's law. I want you to think about these things, meditate on them today. Study God's law, His instructions, and begin to apply your life to them. Remember, you don't do this for your salvation, but because of your salvation. Y'all make it a great day. I love you.